GT Power B3 LiPo Balance Charger is everywhere. If a car comes with a LiPo battery, this is likely the charger, or something very similar, that was in the box. So here's how to use it. The thing that makes the B3 so easy to use is that there's no buttons. Just plug your battery into the only port that it will fit, 2S on the left, 3S on the right, making sure the connector is the right way up. The LEDs will change to red whilst charging, and when the lights are green, you're good to go. A couple of other things. There's some info written on the charger itself. It will charge a 2S battery at 1.5 amps and a 3S at 1 amp but only one at a time. Flashing green LEDs mean it's ready to charge. Red means charging and green means charged. The cell indicator LEDs appear to be wired from right to left, meaning cell one is on the right, cell two is in the middle and cell three is on the left. If you're only charging a 2S 7.4 volt pack, there's only two cells. So the cell three LED will stay green because there's nothing plugged into it. You can cover it up or just ignore it. If you plug your battery in and the LEDs just keep flashing, it's likely that the pack's voltage is too low for the charger to safely work. Contact your local hobby shop as they might be able to help. Lastly, two tips. When your battery is charged, unplug it from the charger. Don't leave the battery plugged into the charger after the charging process is finished. And especially, don't leave it plugged into the charger if you've unplugged the charger from the wall. The circuit is still connected, and this can drain the battery completely flat, causing irreparable damage. The B3 can't storage charge LiPos, but if you don't plan to run your car for a while, don't leave batteries flat, because LiPos hate that. If the mighty B3 is your only charger, just stick your battery back on charge for about half an hour to an hour to top it up. This won't perfectly balance the cells because the B3 doesn't have a proper storage mode function. You'd need a proper smart charger for that, but it's better than leaving them flat. That's it, an easy video for an easy charger. Thanks so much for watching, bye.